Today I'm going to talk about associating courses and Blackboard outcomes. By associating courses, a program can define which courses are a part of a specific degree program. This is also the first step towards creating a curriculum map in the outcomes system. To begin, I suggest having a list of all your program's courses. This will save you time in the process and will help you to ensure that you don't forget to add courses to your program. From your degree program's homepage, click Associate Courses. Once on this page, you will see any courses that have already been associated to your program. If this is the first time this process has been done, your page may be blank. To add courses to your program, click Associate Courses at the top of the page. To select a course, click Browse. A list of all courses at UK has been populated in the Outcomes system. If, while browsing, you find that the system does not have a specific course that you're looking for, please contact the Office of Assessment. At the top of the page, I would suggest leaving the first two search buttons as they are. In the third box, type your search term. I'll type MED for an example. Click Go. A list of all MED classes has been populated. To the left of each course, there's a box. To select a course to add to your program, simply click that box. A check mark should show in the box for each of the courses that you want to associate. It is possible to associate multiple courses at once. Once you have found the courses that you want to add, click Submit at the bottom of the page, and this will bring you back to the previous browsing page. To complete the addition of the course, click Submit on the bottom right of the screen. If you have a variety of courses that you would like to add with different prefixes, simply click the Associate Course button at the top of the page and begin the process again. From here you can browse again for a new set of courses. And that's how you associate courses in Blackboard Outcomes. If you have further questions or comments, please contact Leah Simpson in the Office of Assessment.